Developing out of Virginia Beach, a woman pleaded not guilty to stabbing her mother to death last year. She says she was insane when she did it. India Johnson allegedly killed her mother on Thalia Station in Virginia Beach last June. Ten on your side's Matt Gregory was in the courtroom when Johnson entered her plea. Matt? Yeah, today the judge accepted her plea deal of not guilty by reason of insanity at the time of the crime. Now, one of two things will happen to her. Either she'll be conditionally released or she'll be remanded into state custody, but that is coming up as a decision in July. India Johnson came into the courtroom today. She had two friends in the gallery, and her attorney tells me Johnson had both Risperol, an antipsychotic, and Zoloft in her system as medication today. Her attorney, William Cochran, presented her plea based on the, at the time that police accused her of stabbing her mother. She was in Insane. Now, going forward, a final decision will be made for Johnson in July. Her attorneys tell me she will have evaluations by doctors at the Department of Behavioral and Developmental Services, and after that, they will decide what happens to her. Now, these are the two things that could happen to India Johnson based on the July court date. Now, her attorney tells me she could, she'll stay in custody the entire time in either the Eastern or Central hospitals. And if she is found to need that further, that they will continue to keep her in those hospitals and have a, year, a yearly evaluation uh, as she goes forward. Or, and I was told that off the record from some folks inside some sources, that this could be unlikely, but she could be conditionally released. But, of course, that's all pending another court date in July for India Johnson. That's the latest here in Virginia Beach. I'm Matt Gregory. Ten on your side.